Hey guys, welcome back to No Catch Name. It's me, Ella, and today I'm talking about April's Knit Crate. Hey guys, welcome back. Um, I got my Knit Crate yesterday, and I already opened it because I can't wait. And I wanted to share it with you guys, as I always do every month. And one thing I'm super excited about is the preview for next month. So I can't wait to like get it. I'm hoping there's an orange one because I want an orange one. But yeah, so this month's uh, theme, I forgot. It was, yeah, entomology, which is bugs, study of bugs. So this is their what's it called inspiration photos <laughs> kind of but um <clears throat> yeah so it came with the book as always and two hanks of yarn the book always has uh, at least one crochet and one knit pattern sometimes lately they've been putting the sock pattern in there too and every now and then they put extra patterns <laughs> if you hear anything in the background it's my son i'm filming all right so let's talk about the crochet pattern right yeah I think it's called Chrysalis by a name I'm not going to try to say. It's really pretty. I like this pattern, actually. Can you see it? It's a very pretty pattern, I think. <laughs> but it's all in there. It's an intermediate skill level. And then the knit pattern this month is also really pretty. It's called Canopy by Destiny Meyer. I can say her name. <laughs> I like it a lot. It's pretty, too. What else is in this book? It's also got a graph on it. I know a lot of people like grass. Okay, the sock pattern is Undergrass by Stephanie Lawyer. Um, I hope there's not a glare on it. It's a pretty cool sock pattern. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Let's see. Then it's got information about the designers as usual. And then in the back it's got information about the pop-up shop. Which I think it said April 24th is when it's doing it. No, that's the price. <laughs> I don't know when it's going to do it. You get an email if you're subscribed to their um, newsletter. But here's the pop-up shop this month. It's like a dark green color. It's pretty. And I guess these are the patterns. Oh my gosh. This is making noises. But the preview for next month I was excited about because it's really bright and pretty. It's the main. It's called Farmer's Market, right? Yeah. I'm really hoping there's an orange. I really want an orange knit crate yarn. But um, every month that there's orange in the pictures, there's usually no orange. I'm guessing, I bet there's probably going to be green and blue because they seem to be always making green and blue yarns. Which is actually something I want to talk about in just a second. But yeah, so that's the book that come with it. The yarn that I got. Okay, this is beautiful yarn and I think it's really pretty color. But it looks super similar to the color that came out two or three months ago i can't remember i got it somewhere it's in a project bag so i'm working on it the only thing that's different is the one that came out a few months ago was like tonal and this one is it looks to be a solid color but i got this green color it's like a pretty mint green color i think it's called leaf eater it's aldine wool's um psi dk it's called leaf eater <laughs> uh 20 or no it's not 25 can't read 85 percent merino wool 15 percent cashmere it's dk weight 302 yards per hank so 604 for both of them they just it's a really pretty color it's just it looks just like the one we got a few months ago and it's kind of a bummy and i've noticed something and i've heard other people complaining about it that they've seemed to stick to the same colors every month it seems like there's always a blue or a green or a brown and there's never really any fine bright colors they have these but never this the other uh, color this month is red. The other color this month is red. So I mean I could have gotten a pretty bright color, but I got this green one just like the one I got a few months ago. But uh, it's still a pretty yarn. And actually, I will be giving this away, just not in this video. I've decided to give it away because it looks so similar to the other one that I already kept. This whole set, the two hanks yarn and the book with the patterns in it, I'm going to give away in my 3,000 subscriber giveaway that will be coming out soon. It's going to be late because I'm already over 3,000, but I want to make some project bags for the winter and some crab bags. I'm looking up here because I got some over here. <laughs> then give them this yarn also. So it's going to be a few more weeks before I actually get that video up. <laughs> But yeah, so that's my Knit Crate this month. Um, if you don't know what Knit Crate is, it's a subscription service that uh, is once a month. And you get to pick from a regular crate and sock crate. I think that's the only crates they have now. Uh, the artisan crates were moved over to a thing called Pop-Up Shop, which is where once a month they pop up and you can buy the artisan yarn. I like a discounted price or something. I'm not sure. 100%. 
But yeah, it's it's pretty decent service. I mean, it's really good yarn and patterns. It's just they seem to be sticking with the same color scheme, even though they change the color schemes every month. It's still the same yarns. I think the coolest one we've gotten so far was last month's, the Titmouse. That was like the coolest yarn. I love that. I still got it over there, and I want to make something with it. I just don't know what. So, yeah. But if you're interested in Knit Crate, you can check out my link below. And if you have never had it before, you can use my coupon code, which is no catchy name 20 to get 20% off your first crate. Which is good. And every now and then they have really awesome sales. Like last month in March, they had a, if you subscribe to the Knit Crate, you got another free Knit Crate box for free. I said free twice. But uh, you got four Hanks of Arm. Or three if you got the Tip Mouse one. <laughs> yeah, so that's just a real quick video of my Knit Crate. My No Catch Your Name episode is late this, this week, but um, I'm waiting to finish my project bag so that I can upload it at the same time that my shop is uploaded and uh, be able to announce the shop update and the video all at one time. <laughs> but yeah, so I will see you guys in the next video. Bye guys.